not. <laughs> All right, Fox 24 is your local election headquarters, and the abortion measure signatures collected reportedly fall short of the number needed to qualify for the November ballot, and that's on claims that volunteers did not collect the 100,000 signatures. Now, after a court-mandated counting, the Secretary of State says it's not including signatures gathered by paid canvassers in the count, and that's because a filing group did not properly submit documents regarding the paid canvassers it used. However, the decision on whether or not to count those is up to the state Supreme Court, which has not yet ruled on that. Arkansans for limited government collected about 88,000 signatures through volunteers, a few thousand short of the requirement. Now, should the state Supreme Court decide to count the signatures by the paid canvassers, AFLG says that that number jumps to more than 101,000. The AFLG says that it appreciates election officials complying with the Supreme Court order and says that its optimism remains alive but cautious during this waiting period. The organization did release a statement saying, in part, we are confident that given the facts of this case and the law, the amendment should move forward to the next stage of certification process. We believe that the voices of more than 102,000 Arkansans deserve to be heard. And you can read a statement from Arkansas Attorney General Tim Griffin on those filings from the Secretary of State's office, as well as a timeline of this lawsuit and reactions from Arkansas officials. That's all over on our website, fox24news.tv.